Hello, Steve White, Steve White's 89. Well, we've had a little bit of news on the Wednesday series. Now, I hadn't been paying much attention to this because I kind of not, I'm not really feeling that optimistic about it due to the um, direction of the show. Um, but we have some good news. Christina Ricci is going to be appearing on the show. Now, I didn't know. I, actually, I hadn't even thought about this. I hadn't even thought about her appearing. Some people, I think, I think there was a bit of a push for her to actually appear on the show. Um, either as an older Wednesday or another character. I honestly hadn't thought about it, but, um, okay, so we've got an article here from Deadline, and they are saying that it was announced Christina Ricci, the actor most closely associated with the title character, will be a major part of the live-action show. Ricci, who starred as Wednesday in the 90s, um, will feature a series regular, which is headlined by Jenny Ortega in the title row, role. Uh, details about Richie's role are being kept under wraps to protect the surprise from the surprise from fans. But um, the person here is revealing that she'll play a new character, not an older version of Wednesday. Um, they heard that Wednesday was Richie was brought in following Fora Burtis' exit in mid-production. Richie's playing a new character who is similar to the one originally played by Birch, uh, and will replace it on the show. Uh, Richie quietly has been working on Wednesday for weeks, filming on the MGM produced series uh, slated to wrap in Romania at the end of the month. It's a coming, coming of age comedy written by Smallville creators Al Goch and Miles Miller. It's directed by Burton, starring Ortega. It's basically focusing on her years at um, Nevermore Academy, which is basically a Monsters Academy. So the whole thing is instead of. The Adams Family was about. A series of unusual people and them you know dealing with the normal world this series is Wednesday is going to a monsters Academy where the whole area is just full of vampires and werewolves and and it really makes the Adams family not special because um, compared to that level of paranormal creatures really the Adams family are pretty ordinary so it's it's really not going to work um, yep now in addition to Ortega, uh, Richie stars alongside Catherine Zeta-Jones as Morticia and Luis Guzman as Gomez. Uh, there's been a couple other announcements, but um, we still don't know. I don't think we have all the casting. I think that they've managed to keep quite a bit secret, actually, which, I don't know, maybe Romania is good at keeping in the secrets as opposed to Hollywood, where you normally hear everything and everything leaks. Um, what else? Yeah, some people were calling for her to be cast in the show, and some people were hoping that she'd play an older Wednesday, or I don't know if she's going to be a member of the family, or if, um, I don't know what Flora Birch's character was. Um, I think that's it. Burton executive, executive produces Wednesday with Goff and Miller, who serve as showrunners. Also executive producing are a whole bunch of people I don't care about. I'm not going to read through all their names, because there's about seven of them. Um, and Richie will return for season two of Yellow Jackets. I thought they were about to say she's going to come back for season two of this show, but she's working on other shows. She's very busy, so she stepped into Flora Birch's role, um, and it's great to have her on the show because she is Wednesday Adams. But um, it's kind of like um, Cassandra um, Peterson, um, who was um, um, Elvira, appearing on The Monsters as just a regular real estate person, just a regular person. If she's anything other than a member of the Adams family, if she's just a regular person, it's going to be very disappointing. I mean, yes, she's on the show. You get to go, oh, look, there's Christina Ricci. She was Wednesday in the movies. But I wanted to... I don't, okay, she can't be Wednesday. Well, hell, she could. They could do an adult Wednesday series. Um, it'd be interesting to see what her Adams family would be like if she married and, and had kids. I think that would be far more interesting than having a teen goth Wednesday in a Monsters Academy where it's just... Um, yeah, it's not going to work. So I'm going to go. Feel free to share, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think. I, I, I do, I'm glad that they're honouring her by having her in the series. Um, but if she's playing anything other than a member of the Adams Family and a regular character, it's just going to be disappointing once the initial, oh, there's Christina Ricci sort of passes. So I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Um, I really am hope. I don't know, I'm really hoping that the, the overall show is not as bad as it sounds. I mean, it just sounds like just, I don't know, just a Monsters Academy, just a whole bunch of creatures, and Wednesday is going to be the least interesting 
Although, I think they're giving her paranormal powers now. So that's the thing, they have to make her paranormal to compete with all the other creatures. It's, uh, it's just, it's not the Adams Family. That's not what the Adams Family was. The Adams Family wasn't a supernatural world. It was a normal world, and they were the unusual supernatural um, freakish ones. So, yeah, it's... I'll watch it, but I'm not... You know, I'm not looking forward to it. So... Good news, Christina Ricci is in it. Bad news, it's still the series that it, you know, is, is, is. So I'm going to go. Bye.